Ah, here we are, and welcome to Operation Portobello Mushroom. I have absolutely no idea what's going on, and barely know what the fuck was added in this patch. So before we get into a game, let's let's see what they changed in the operator section. Now, first, first order of business. First order of business. The, you see how beautiful that man is? Well, prepare to cream. Because look at that man. Operation Nimrod? They couldn't come up with a better name for that one? I feel like they could have came up with a better name. But you got, I gotta. I, I literally, I just knew it was gonna happen. The moment I fucking saw a Thatcher or a Smoke, I was getting that shits. Look at that. Yeah, I wanna equip it, motherfucker. Why wouldn't I? Look at that. Look at that man. Look at those mutton chops going into a not even full goatee because he's just, he doesn't look like he sounds though. He doesn't look like he goes fucking laser sights. But you know what? We'll forgive him. We gotta edit that loadout though. I don't even know what the camo looks like to be honest with you. A whole literally English. I think it's that one. Or is it that one? It's that one. Oh, that's cool looking. I don't mind that. I like when they actually kind of look a little bit realistic. I don't know half the camos I have, to be honest with you. Then you got a an, a charm, which I'm not going to use, but, I mean, the option's there. So, but now that we have Thatcher out of the way, let's go see our boy Maestro and Alibi. Deploys a hologram of alibi and tags hostiles when fired upon or when they walk through a remote control bulletproof camera armed with a high energy laser. This seems like it's gonna go real well. He dude's got a level three backpack like he's playing PUBG or some shit. So what do we got? Default or mountain foliage? Why do I not see any difference? Oh. This is a little bit more green. What do you what is that doesn't even look that's not worth it. That's not worth the renown. I would never buy that shit. Get the red one and the not red one. I'm gonna keep the red one. That looks a lot better, to be honest with you. We're gonna edit that loadout real quick. What the fuck is this? Why the fuck would you use this one when you could use this one that has more damage and more? I don't see why you would use the bailiff. I'm a little bit confused there, but okay. We're gonna go with the muzzle break, obviously, because you can see the fucking shit that has. No need for a laser. I don't, I don't use that on anything. The mask scheme. Obsidian always looks good, but so does diamond. Even though diamond looks different in here than it does in-game. What are the seasonal skins? I like that one. That one's not bad either. I usually don't buy seasonal skins, though, if I'm being 100% honest there. But this one does have a sight. That's probably why they, like... People would want to use it anyways. It's because it's got a sight. But that's besides the point. I didn't make it to diamond last season. In case anyone was actually wondering. I only made it to plat. But don't worry. We're going to get diamond this fucking season. Disregard that gold. And that bronze and that silver. <laughs> We're going to get better one day guys. I swear. So now that we got that gun out of the way. I'm oh, the fucking AA-12 though. The ACS-12, actually. I don't I don't want to have to use it. I really don't. What's the point of either grip with the recoil that this fucking thing's going to have? It's an AA-12. I'm just going to toss a fucking laser on it. It's not like it's going to matter with this gun. This thing... I don't know if I'm ever going to want to use the AA-12. It's just going to... It's just going to be so sad to use that I don't want to have to fucking deal with it. Could you imagine if this shit had a if it had an ACOG? It wouldn't matter. But could you imagine? Let's see what Alibi's got. See, personally, I don't know if there's a point to using any of Alibi's other stuff because her holograms Her holograms use her default skin. So is is there really even a point to switching? Cause it would make more sense to click stick with the default being is that's what she has in the holograms like that's a cool skin i wouldn't mind having it but i think i'm just gonna stick with that because that's what she and, and even her guns too her guns oh she also has an aa-12 well fuck me even with the mx4 storm like it also is fucking i don't know if there's a point small burst 
uh, full damage over a longer distance. Yeah, yeah. Probably gonna go with the compensator as well. We'll go with angled grip on that. And there's probably not even a point of putting a camel on it. If you really want to stick true to like the the way the gun actually is, because she's just gonna be running around with a naked gun on her on her holograms. So I really don't know if there's a fucking point to doing that. I really don't think there is. Like there's no point to a sight. I I don't I don't know. I'm probably looking way too deep into something that doesn't matter. Um, so what we're going to end up doing is we're just going to try to find a match over here on Villa. Cuz I haven't I haven't touched this yet. So we're going to we're going to see what we can do. If I can end up doing well this game. Didn't they also add, they added the bulletproof camps, right? Oh yeah, I forgot they, they added this, so the HUD looks different. I'm liking it so far. Operators load out. I'm gonna go with Thatch Daddy, obviously, because look at that fucking sexy motherfucker. And I always go with the AR. I don't know why that's like my favorite one. You can't pick where you're fucking going anyways, but I'm totally ready. Look at that boy. Jumping in, bitch. Alright, so I'm not even near... I don't even think this is gonna matter. Oh, Prisma? So that's an alibi thing. Well, that was some good accuracy. No. Put one there. That's a fucking giant thing. You might as well put it in the objective room, right? Like, that makes the most sense. To me, at least. It's pretty fucking metal. So, I want to see what these bitches look like. Just give me a second to get used to that cam shit. Alright, so that's how that works. Alright, good to know. That was scary. <laughs> I wasn't expecting it. Hi, Valk. I'm terrified right now. She's down there. Oh, nice kill. Uh, okay, so bullets, uh, they don't necessarily kill people a lot. That's good to know. Reload! 
located a bomb. Get ready to engage. I hope that works. But I honestly got no clue. That kind of looks like she would be peeking that. I mean, if you come out of nowhere, you're, gonna, you're probably going to shoot that, so. Well, I fucking suck. I hate this game. I, re I fucking do. Why? What did I do? Well, I'm loaded in, pieces of shit. Don't fucking... Try to vote kick me. Ass clowns. Find the biohazard. Now what? The fuck do you want from me? There's one guy, dude. Please don't fucking vote kick me. That's I fucking knew it. Why? Friendly operator remaining. Down to ten seconds. Well, I love this game. See how well this fucking goes. My answer is, is not. It's gonna end very badly. What do you want from me? Stop voting to kick me. At the biohazard container. Protect the biohazard. Attempting to secure the container. Well, I tried. All and if I didn't run out of ammo, I totally could have fucking had him. <laughs> Reach it, bitch. Hurts my head. That's also a fake one. Okay, that doesn't help us with where they are. Why? Oh, because it was that faggot again. I love this game. We're gonna blow it. anything that round, but I'll take it. I'm just 
not even there. What a sexy beast, honestly. Those are the only words I got. <laughs> well, if there's one thing we learned today, it's that casual is toxic as fuck. <laughs> Uh, you know what I'm going to do right now is I'm going to keep playing, though. I'm going to try to, you know, figure out what's going on with this meta, get better with Maestro and Alibi both. So, thank you guys for sticking around and watching this video. And as always, I will see you guys in the next one. Cheerio, mates.